Hello, my name is Nick Marchese, and today we will go, be going through a class the video on Google Workspace updates from November 2024. Now, keep in mind that not all of these updates are fully released yet. Um, some were announced as recently as a couple of days ago, um, but we're going to go through what we think are the best updates over the last month and show those to you here. So uh, the first one is that Google Vids, uh, Google's AI powered video creation app, is now generally available for uh, select SKUs. So this was in pilot and beta for a little while, and now it's generally available for teams to uh, create video content based off of um, different things within their drive um, quickly and easily without getting into the nitty gritty of video creation. Um, and to create powerful uh, marketing materials and team recaps, et cetera. Check out Google Video, Google Vids now. Uh, within Google Chat, there's this uh, new functionality that's gonna be coming through, um, and this is highly requested to create custom sections within Google Chat, so you can move um, different uh, messages, direct messages between different people to custom sections. So you can see in this little video here, um, we're moving this one uh, user by going to the menu bar there and moving that conversation. And we're going to make a custom section for that user as a way to group them a little bit more easily and naturally for myself and how I can find them. Um, and this one will show off a little bit. Um, so Google Slides uh, got a refresh library of templates, which is really exciting. Um, and this is different than themes. So templates have uh, multiple uh, uh, slides um, that are within um, a whole essentially themed uh, template um, for uh, title slide and content slides and all that jazz. So let's pop over to a new slideshow. So when I do this, I can click this little templates button here and it pops out on the right side. And you see all of these templates here, which are so great. Uh, I'm gonna click just one of these and then if I go, when I click that, you can see I go into it and it has all of these uh, different slides, types of slides within that template for me. So I just click this, I go ahead and add that, I click the next one, <clears throat> it'll add those. And then obviously you go in and tweak it and update it to make it uh, personalized. Um, but you can, or you can go ahead and hit insert all and it'll insert one copy of all of the slides. Uh, check those out, really helpful and exciting. Another update is within Google Meet. So the automatic framing within Google Meet has been out for a while. So that way, if you move slide to side on, a, uh, on your screen, it'll go ahead um, and automatically frame, but it was mostly doing it when you were first entering the meeting. Um, so now it's automatically happening as well during the meeting and um, when it's gonna go ahead and factor in virtual backgrounds. So you can see in this little uh, video here, right, as the user moves, uh, out of the frame, it starts to recenter um, them into the middle um, within, and the virtual background stays exactly how it was. Um, within Google Docs, um, if you've seen within uh, Sheets, a little pop out for tables that's coming in the right side, um, Docs is getting a similar thing for building blocks. So there'll be more uh, options for building blocks, which will basically be building out little uh, tables within docs here. Um, and that's gonna be coming soon uh, so you can quickly get started with different building blocks. Um, within Google Drive, there's a um, smoother, more modern video interface. Um, finally got a facelift. I'll jump over to a video here. You can see what that looks like. If I hover over, we got a nice new big play and pause button. I've got uh, advance and rewind 10 seconds, and then larger, clearer buttons on how to go ahead and navigate our video. We hope you've appreciated uh, this video going over the Google Workspace updates from November 2024. If you have any questions about any of the features, please feel free to reach out to us. Thanks so much.